Looks like Christmas has come up a bit early this year, Tom. What you got, the neighbouring? Something. What do you mean, something? A reasonable fare. You'll have to pay to see me, I think. Foolish food. There is you five bad. <coughs> Who you call foolish? It's a figure of speech, my friend. A figure of speech. Where'd you get that silver? I purloined it. <laughs> grateful Spaniards could better. And why were they so grateful, may I ask? <laughs> grateful they didn't kill them. After all, I had their ship. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, bloody rogue. <laughs> Let's see that hand, Mr. Avery.
my hand, I believe. Ah! Mind waiting to disappoint you, Calico? How come you always win, Avery? That's simple, Calico. Because I cheat. Why, you? Leave it, Jack. I said leave it! Hardly a trace of blood, Avery. You ain't got no blood, Jack. Your veins is full of salt water. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen her! She's back! Seen who? Madeline Rogers! Madeline Rogers! Can't be, she's dead. It must be her ghost! I saw her! We all saw her! She's dead. I saw it myself. The brig, Reuben James. She was on it. Never mind that. Where is the rest of the salvage? Still on the beach! We ran like hell! On the beach, you fool! Barnacles men will have it by now. But the ghost! Ghosts! Bloody ghosts! I ain't scared of no ghosts! I ain't scared of no ghosts! Are you not scared of ghosts then, Greek? Who's that? Who's there? A friend, Herodes. Or someone who used to be a friend. One move and you'll have an all in your head as big as Pingle's cane. What do you want? That ship you wrecked, the Royal Charter. That was my ship, my cargo. We didn't know, otherwise... Otherwise what? You still have wrecked her and celebrated sending me and the crew to the bottom of the sea. We thought you were dead. Wishful thinking. Now, where is it? Where's what? The box. Box? What box? It washed ashore with the wreckage. Box? We saw no box. Search the cave, girls. Every nook and cranny. Quick, quick. What will Madeline say? About your business, Annie. Just what is it you're looking for, Madeline? Must be something. Something mighty important. That's my business. What's in the box? Nothing that might concern you, Calico. Anyway, what are you doing here? The last time our paths crossed, you were on the Queen Anne with Teach, off Port Royal. So what, so you're down there, was it? Hot in love. Anything? Just brandy. Some of our cargo, some black powder. No box, Captain. Black powder, eh? My box. Someone has it. And if it's not returned, I promise I'll be back. And by fire and flood, blood and bone, I'll hang everyone's guts from the roof of this cave. Well, gentlemen, I'll bid you farewell. Oh, I almost forgot. I've left you a present. Something to jog your memories, you might. Safe. What does she mean, a present? Powder. Powder! Isn't it, Calico? Gold? Silver? Something more interesting. Ain't that right, Avery? Something to make that bitch Madeline's neck hairs bristle. Are we down there, Captain? 
Hi, they're down there, watching us, watching them. You sure it was the right grave, Calico? The only one with a decent headstone, and his name hard in the sled. The one much left of him. I don't told we were in that sea. That bad luck. The devil's spawn. Well, they bested you, Creed, is up in the cave. <laughs> they bested all of us. Hey, Rabbit, my boss. Let's go and get it. Don't be so hasty, Annie. Give them some exercise. Let them dig. We have it! Hey. Kids treasure map! Is, Captain, open it. What kind of trick is this? your map, Captain. It's a note. Read it. You know I can't read. I'll give it here. What does it say? It says, we thought you might like someone to keep you company, Madeline. So we dug up a relative of yours from Los Pasos Cemetery. The blackguards. What is it, Captain? They'll pay for this. They'll pay. Who? Who is it? Joshua Rogers. Who? My father. Tide's going out. Well, we must be on our guard. Keep away from the cave. Madeline, she be after us. Well, I'm ready. I won't let the witch sneak up on me again. The cold steel will stop her, and I've got my blunder. What about the map? Don't worry, Avery's got it safe. You sure it's kid's map? Yes, it's got his secret mark in the corner. WK, and his special cross. Oh, very well. But can we understand it? <laughs> Calico will figure it out. Remember, him and Kid used to sail together on the adventure galley. Well, it is all right. It's easy to recognize his hand, and you never could spell. Can you spell? I'm learning better than kid. What about these markings? Is this some kind of code? Our William was a clever man, to be sure. But can you understand it? Hmm, the shape's right. I remember we pulled in there for shelter when the Chinook was blowing. The island was shaped like a humpback. Humpback? A whale, my dear James. A whale. Can you find it? Yes, but the diggings. It'll take time to figure the code. This island. The island. Where? Where is it?
gone. The cave is empty, Captain. Gone, eh? <laughs> I knew I'd go back up there. The rats had bolted down their holes. Send Buck and Bonnie down through the woods. Tell them to follow the men. Keep undercover. Aye, aye, Captain. We'll have him yet, my buckos. We'll have him. This is Madeline's work. It's a warning. It's one of Barbicamp's men. I don't know. It's Israel Davis. I think his back side. Island. You say Whale Island? It's small and we can cross to it at low water? Whaleback Island. Aye, we can, but it's a climb. This map, you think you've deciphered it? Well, one or two things I'm not sure of. Like what? Be sure he'll make us hard to uncover its secret. Do you know that he once sent the governor of New Providence a basket with a swarm of bees inside? Oh. <laughs> the map! But the map! I was coming to that. Well? Oh yes, it says we have to find a pile of white stones and take seven paces west and dig down three feet. We'll have to watch our backs with Madeline here back on his Faniola. <laughs> what that bitch needs is good in and out. <laughs> She's already had that. <laughs> <laughs> that you, the whole crew. The whole bloody crew boy. The whole crew. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have to tell Karidis about the map. Wait a minute, Jack. Why not tell him it's a fake? What's boss for the rest of us? Ah, Karidis won't fall for that one. Say Never can trust the Greek. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to go now, Calico. We're going to the sugar mill to meet Caridis.
And you say this is a fake? Yes, that's not kid's mark, is it, Calico? No, it's a forgery. It looked genuine to me. Yesterday you say it was kid's mark. Yes, but Jack Sayle was kid. He said it's not his appendix mark. Then why does Madeline want it so badly? Her mind is going. She thinks it's genuine. Then maybe we should let her have it. Don't let her have it. Why? So why let her have it? We can use this as a bargaining chip, maybe, like. You boys ain't trying to cheat me, are you? Would we do that? We're all brothers here, Corinne. Brothers in the trade. 